At school, the only way my voice was heard was if I didn't drown in a sea of hands or ridiculing giggles. As a baby, I'd cry thick, sticky tears to get attention, but you can't do that on the tube, can you? So now, when I stand up in a room, my consonants and vowels are so weighed down with meaning they trip over my teeth so that all you hear is a stutter, a hesitation sound with the potential of being so profound but just wasn't. So now the pages are the only things I talk to. The biro strokes the page the way that somebody else used to. The dots and lines help redefine what it is to feel something precious. I hide in the margins. I take refuge from the, in the curves of the letters and I take sanctuary in the sacred silence of a full stop. I let the ink rub through my veins. These words become my bloodstains on a paper. This biro scratches all the way to my soul. I let you in by letting the ink flow out. These pages are my voice now. This notebook is a platform, a platform to a stage, a stage to finally make you listen to what I have to say.